the topic today for me personally is um, the housing situation, um, especially here in Brighton here. Um, because it's just kind of like back to fun. There's um, sort of one rule for one, one for another. People like myself and other people that are not close to me are not getting the help that they should be getting because um, they're maybe they show a bit more strength or whatever, but we've all got the same problems. But I know probably half a dozen people who have been housed uh, in Brighton. Um, and a few of them have only been here like since like maybe two or three years. So, me personally, because obviously um, I didn't go down the mental health route, uh, didn't get medication, um, and I've worked kind of on and off mostly, um, there's no really, they can't leave you to it. So they've got the system wrong, it's not working right. Um, it's like you, you've got, if you can't beat them, you've got to join them because, um, yeah, I mean, when these guys, I know, got the same problems I've got, but they just went through the channels, which ticks all, ticks all the boxes, um, probably makes money, generates money, and um, people like myself who are uh, in the same boat as them are just not getting the help that you should be getting. Um, and I'm not the only one, there's a few of us. Um, so it's, it's frustrating, um, and it's something that I want to make a point about and make, and make this topic uh, today about the fact that we've got the system wrong. And it needs a big shake up, um, influence maybe from people like myself or people that are look at, that are standing looking in and not getting the help and support that they should be getting. Um, and I just want to raise that point because it's, it's frustrating, it's difficult, and just just to sit back and watch. I mean, good luck to these people that have got these places. Um, but I mean, I've been in this town longer than most of them, and I've kind of been left uh, on the peripheral because um, I show a bit of strength and, and go to work. And, um, and I think the pandemic thing is we kind of like trying to go over that uh, officially, like incumbently, um, and. Yeah, so that's the topic for today on that one. Uh, thanks very much. Nice one. And I just don't get it. Like, I don't understand it. And this applies to a lot of people. I'm like, most of these people are pissheads. Um, and I've been on both sides. And I've been I've been in the gutter. And I've been uh, the highlight for a good life. Yeah. So now I'm kind of like in no man's land. I don't know what's going on. Um, the helps. He feels you don't really drain the resources, yeah? You don't want to ask them for help because you can see there's just only human like me and you and whatever else and they're struggling. So I kind of like step back a bit. Well, it's time for me to step back in. I need some fucking help. Can you help me? Can anybody help me? <laughs> it's terrible. Um, it's like I don't know where to start now because I've been through all of them all. And, and I'm speaking I'm speaking for a lot of other people. Because um, it's like both sides. There's people that have all been housed and good luck to them all. Um, I wish them all the best. And then you've got people like myself and other people who I know who are just aren't getting that support and help because they're not as needy um, but that doesn't mean to say that that you've not got the same issues and problems as the other people so it's like if you can't beat them join them um, I feel as though I now have to go down that route the route I didn't want to go down um, just to get housed in Brighton because um, it's kind of get frustrating and people just walks into town and getting housed and taking accommodation and uh, but then again, I do know people in this town who have got a full-time job, like myself and other people, who, because it's quite high rent-wise to live here, so they are struggling. Um, and just renting rooms and jumping about from room to room for six months here and six months here. Um, so it's just, so it's, it's like the people that are really trying are not getting the support. They're not getting the help. And the ones that just don't give a fuck and are, you know, they're wrapped up in their addiction, um, all get the help that people like myself and others who are not very close to me are not, I'm not there, it's just not happening. Um, so yeah, Creepy Nick is over now, thank you.